May the 4th. This woman had a loud and full body orgasm during LA Philharmonic concert. <laughs> Let's play the video. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, run that back, son. Look at it, check it out. So this is the New York Post. Uh, there's another one. We'll get to that one here. There are several witnesses. Describe the woman's climatic moment uh, Friday from the balcony. Packed Walt Disney concert hall <laughs> all things too. This is the quote here. Everyone kind of turned to see what was happening. Uh, somebody was sitting near the overjoyed woman. <laughs> told the Los Angeles Times. So they took this from the LA Times. So uh, yeah, let's get off of this New York Post then. We got the LA Times article right here. So here we go. Witnesses offer conflicting accounts. This is the thing. It's been uh, debated in this uh, viral situation that is happening. Enjoying a performance. Heard what she described as a scream slash moan erupt from the balcony. The quote, everyone kind of turned to see what was happening. I saw the girl after it happened, and I assumed that she had an orgasm because she was heavily breathing, and her partner was smiling and looking at her like in an effort to not shame her. <laughs> These people are sitting right next to her they saw it. That's, that's where all this is coming from here. Multiple people who attended reported hearing a woman making a moaning noise during a symphony's second movement. <laughs> this guy here, uh, this, this symphony is uh, during the Romantic era too. So one attendee composer and music producer Magnus Fienis described the sound on Twitter as a uh, person having a quote loud and full body orgasm. An alleged audio recording of that moment where somebody could be heard crying out during a quiet beat in the music making the rounds on social media. Attendees who spoke to the time said that the clip was similar to what they'd heard. Here goes some more uh, quote right here. Friends who went to the LA Philharmonic last night are reporting that in the middle of the show, some lady had a screaming orgasm, and screaming is all caps here, to the point where the whole orchestra stopped playing. Some people really know how to live. <laughs> dot, dot, dot is the quote. <laughs> The Times has since confirmed that the orchestra kept performing and that there were no further disruptions, still unclear exactly what occurred in the audience. The Times has contacted the LA Phil for comment, not been able to identify or contact the person who made the sound. <laughs> They're embarrassed. Maybe they're not, I don't know. <laughs> it's quite the spectacle. Other audience members disputed the orgasm theory, offering that the woman could have made the noise while waking after fall have fallen asleep. It's like, <laughs> okay. Some worry that it could have been related to a medical condition or emergency. It's like, yeah, of course, people are paranoid freaks. One attendee who was seated in the road directly behind the person who had made the noise said it appeared as if the woman was waking up from sleep attack when she made the sound. This is the quote. Pretty quickly, she sort of fell onto her partner's shoulders and then onto his lap. Then her body went limp, recalled the audience member. Maybe like five seconds later, she kind of awoke and that's when she let out a scream. Audience member who was seated in the row behind her said she had previously witnessed a person with narcolepsy experience in a sleep, sleep attack and what she saw in LA Phil seemed similar. Psh, whatever. Try to relate it to your own experience. So this is making its rounds, apparently. After a woman made a noise, her partner and another woman seated next to her asked if she was okay, and she replied she was, according to the audience member, who reported overhearing the exchange. Quote, I know someone else mentioned she was smiling, but I'm pretty sure she was just really embarrassed because other people were looking at her. There was another one that I saw earlier, too. Here's the quote. One can't know exactly what happened, but it seemed very clear from the sound that it was an expression of pure physical joy. A sort of classical music equivalent of the scene in a movie where someone is talking loudly in a party or a nightclub. And then the record suddenly stops and they say something that everyone hears. Yeah, well, whatever. Said so described it as, quote, rather wonderful and refreshing. And said, 
There was a sort of gasp in the audience, but I think everyone felt it was rather lovely expression of someone who was so transported by the music, it had some kind of effect on them physically or, dare I say, even sexually. <laughs> It's supposed to be like a romantic era type piece. <laughs> so she was smiling afterwards and uh, the, the person next to her, her partner, was smiling afterwards, was like smirking afterwards. Talk about what music can do, right? She was literally feeling that music. <laughs> she was literally feeling that in more ways than one. <laughs>